a smiling, healthy-looking King Charles returned to public duties on Tuesday. The British monarch's visit to a London cancer treatment centre was his first engagement since being diagnosed with the disease himself in February. Buckingham Palace announced on Friday that doctors were sufficiently pleased with the 75-year-old King's response to treatment for the unspecified form of cancer and that he would be able to resume some public-facing engagements. King Charles, who has become the new patron of the Cancer Research UK charity, met patients and medical specialists at the University College Hospital Macmillan Centre with his wife, Queen Camilla. Charles's health issues began in January when it was revealed that he would be undergoing a corrective procedure for a benign enlarged prostate. The following month, the palace said tests had uncovered the presence of a form of cancer. It offered no further details beyond saying that it did not involve his prostate. The King has been resting and undergoing cancer treatment since then, continuing with official state duties in private. He was well enough to greet well wishes after an Easter church service at the end of March. While his diary will be carefully managed to minimise any risks to his health, the palace says he may attend some annual events. Those could include the Trooping the Colour military parade and the commemorations to mark the 80th anniversary of the World War II D-Day landings, both in June. The palace has also confirmed Charles and Camilla will host a state visit by the Japanese Emperor Naruhito and his wife, Empress Masako, in late June. Charles's illness came less than 18 months after he succeeded his mother, Queen Elizabeth.